Flight rates to St. Lucia are increasing and sent to Tucson during the summer, a peak time for the destination, particularly affecting visitors from the European market. Minister of Tourism, Honorable Dr. Ernest Hillet, says despite increased air rates, St. Lucia's plan of action is to maintain its position as a top tourism destination in the region. Hillet notes the increased prices will indeed pose a challenge to St. Lucia, it's the nature of the industry. As an industry that has some sensitivity to price, um, any significant increase in price will affect demand. And especially if you're speaking about Europe, which is going for its own economic challenges, particularly the United Kingdom, where inflation has not been reduced as quickly as other parts of the world, um, there, there will always be um, some effect. And as much as individuals are traveling like never before, especially since COVID, and it continues to, to, to grow, you know, they, there's only so much people can take. Hiller notes that the increase will have its effects and they are monitoring it as well as room rates have also increased. It will have its effects and of course some of the room rates are also increasing. If you compare the room rates now to what they were before COVID, they too have increased. So you can understand the challenges people will face for traveling now. Um, so we will always be watching very closely um, those developments already the, the rates to St. Lucia, the FS to St. Lucia are high um, but it reflects a lot the demand for the destination and the, the whole question of supply of equipment and, and crew and whatnot so yes we will always be concerned. As a result, the tourism minister says one of the key ways to keep the island as a leading destination in the region is to engage all tourism stakeholders to see how best they can play a pivotal role in dealing with instances such as these. I think there, there has to be a discussion of all stakeholders in terms of how can each contribute to make sure that Central remains competitive. Um, remember, you know, in terms of just basic um, economics, you know, you, you want to remain competitive. Uh, and therefore, you have to always figure out that you cannot allow yourself to fall out of, of, of the competitive range. And therefore, the, any thinking and response has to be to make sure that you know, we are still in the forefront as a destination of choice. The minister addressed the issue at Monday's February 26th pre-cabinet press briefing. For Choice News Now, I am Chelsea Austin.